I guess I like to have a voice for the people that don't, but I also like to educate not just um, non-natives. I love to educate Native people about um, certain theories, certain oppressions, a lot of oppression, I guess. My name is Marina Skeets, and I'm 19, no, oh, sorry, I'm 20 years old. And I am from Gallup, New Mexico. I go to school at Santa Fe University of Art and Design as a full-time student. You know, growing up in Gallup, growing up here, not really getting a taste of what a privileged life, I guess you could say. I try not to use privilege too much, but I feel like that's the best way I can, you know, uh, express what I'm trying to say. So when you come really from nothing, you don't really expect much, is what I've learned. I go to school with a lot of uh, very privileged people, and my school is very expensive, but I'm lucky enough to have a scholarship. So what I see around Gallup is a very, very strong Native community that is very much so stuck. Um, and I know a lot of kids that I went to school with, everybody's just like, oh, fuck Gallup. I don't care about Gallup. I'm glad to move away. Gallup is a very hard place to grow up because there's not a lot around, there's not a lot that comes around, and the majority of it is drinking, drugs, and I mean, whatever else there is would do other than party, there's not anything. So I like to play with these ideas of capturing what it's like to come here, what it's like to grow up here. It's not at all, you know, beautiful scenes of Native women and men traditionally dressed and you know, their beautiful flock of sheep and cattle, like all these paintings that I see around here, I'm not like degrading them or anything, but I like to see, I like to bring to the table something real, something that people can relate to, something that people can understand at more of the, not just, oh yeah, I'm Navajo, but oh yeah, I've lived that, I see that every day, I know that's there. you're never going to see what it's like. And a lot of them don't really know anything. Like, they're, oh, you're Navajo? What is that? Can you say something? <laughs> and I'm just, there's more than just saying hello. There's more than just being a Navajo. There's more than being non-privileged. There's more than being poor. There's culture still beneath that. And I'd like, I like to see the world as the Navajo trying to balance this culture along with modern times and at the same time you're at the bottom of the list so how does that work how do you control all of that how do you have this balance and harmony i have no idea i'm just, i'm just trying to capture what's happening So the show is coming up next week and I'm super excited for it. This is my first show that as I guess somebody's been taking serious about. So I'm really excited to work with Chris Easley and Evie. I'll be doing a lot of paintings. Um, I bought I think about seven or six skateboards. So majority of it's going to be on skateboards and there's going to be um, maybe a couple other like random pieces in there. But it'll be painted skateboards. Yeah. I think art means it means God. It is God because it's everywhere, it's everything, and I feel like that's what God should be. This idea and it puts faith, it puts joy, it it puts every kind of emotion you can into something, into one little thing. And you're free to do whatever you want with it. You can believe in it, you can put your faith in it, you can cry over it and you can get angry, you can even destroy it, but it's still hard. <laughs>